Assalomu alaykum do'stlar, mening ismim Asilbek. Bugun biz sizlar bilan 15 ta ingliz tilidagi hayvonlar bilan bog'liq bo'lgan idiomalarni ko'rib chiqamiz. Kelinglar, boshlaymiz. Birinchi idioma, horsing around. Horsing around qachon kiysiz? Nimanidir shovqin bilan qilganingizda horsing around so'zini ishlatsangiz bo'ladi. Okay, you can use the structure when you have done something loudly. When you use in the particular situation. For example, if your husband is going to have a nap and your children are playing loudly in the living room, you can say Guys, please stop horsing around. It will mean please calm down. Next idiom with horse is hold your horses. Hold your horses nima degani? Qachonki biz bir ishni shijoat bilan yoki qattiq xohish bilan qilayotganimizda, biz shoshilamiz. Inglizlar bizni shu holatda hold your horses, ya'ni otlaringni ushlab tur desak bo'ladi. For example, if your friend is going to get into the university, you can say him, hold your horses, keep calm and take it easy. Kengi idioma, let's Start with chicken. Joja bilan boshlaymiz. Chicken out. Chicken out degani qachon kiysiz, nimadandir qo'rqib qochib ketganingizda bu jumlani ishlatsangiz bo'ladi. Okay? If you go somewhere with your close friend, for example to the lake and your close friend plunge into the water and you are not going to do it because you are afraid of the depths, you can say you have I am chicken out. Qachon kiysiz do'stingiz bilan ko'lga borsangiz, do'stingiz suvga sho'ng'isa yo, lekin siz sho'ng'ish olmasangiz suvning chuqurligidan qo'rqib, shu holatda siz chicken out idiomasini ishlatsangiz bo'ladi. Wooden hard a fly. Pashshalar bilan bo'lgan bir qiziq idioma. When we can use that idiom. We can use when we are going to talk about a strong, big person, but he's a soft touch in his heart. Biz bu idiomani qachonki kuchli va haybat Gavdali inson, lekin yuragida ochiq ko'ngil bo'lgan inson haqida etsak bo'ladi. Haybatli inson, lekin birovlarga ozor yetkazmaydigan kishi haqida he wouldn't hurt a fly deb etsak bo'ladi. Next idiom. Okay, gets my goat. What does mean gets my goat? Goat so'z ingliz tilida echki deb tarjima qilinadi. Get my goat idiomasi mening asabimga tegyapti. It's annoying me deb tushunsak bo'ladi. Keyingi idioma It means that it is the hottest day in the summer. You know, in Uzbekistan there is a heat wave. Uzbekistonda chilla davri bor. Chilla davri dogs day deb etsak bo'ladi. Kengsi. Okay. Don't let the cat out of the bag. Mushukni qutidan chiqarib yuborma. Bu nima degani? When you are going to talk about something which was suggested like a secret and you can going to talk about it, your friend can say you. Don't let the cat out of the bag. Qachon ki siz nimadir haqida aytayotganingizda va sizning do'stingiz shu holatda sizga bu idiomani ishlatsa, bu narsa sirni ochib qo'yma degan ma'noni bildiradi. Okay. Being an elephant in the room. Xonaning ichida fil bo'lmoq. Bu idioma juda qiziq ma'noga ega. Qachon ki siz do'stlaringiz davrasida yoki odamlar orasida bu idiomani ko'rsangiz, bu degani gapirilishi lozim tutilmagan mavzuni ishlatsak bo'ladi. Being a big fish in a small pond. Kichkina ko'ldagi katta baliq bo'lmoq. It means being an important person in the small community. Bu kichkina jamiyatdagi muhim inson bo'lmoq degani. Okay, let's move to the next one. Pigs. Endi cho'chqalar bilan bo'lgan idiomalar. Pig-headed person. What does mean pig-headed person? Cho'chqa boshli inson, ajoyib eshitilsa kerak, albatta. Bu idiomaning ma'nosi stubborn, ya'ni qaysar inson haqida etsak bo'ladi. My friend is pig-headed. He always does what he wants. Mening do'stim juda qaysar inson. U har doim o'zi xohlagan narsani qiladi. Okay, next idiom we speak is pick out. What does mean pick out? Cho'chqalar tashqarida. Yo'q, buning ma'nosi ozgina o'zgacha. Bu idiomaning ma'nosi qachonki siz ovqat yeyishga o'tirsangiz u, lekin vaqtingiz bo'lmasa yoki ovqatni juda tez va palapartish talamul qilsangiz, siz bu idiomani ishlatsangiz bo'ladi. For example, we can you can use this idiom when you are going to talk about someone who is eating his food or her food really fast, eating it crazy. Okay? Next idiom. What does mean next idiom? When pigs fly. Qachonki cho'chqalar uchganda. Guys, when pigs fly, of course they will never fly. Cho'chqalar hech qachon uchmaydi. Masalan, bu idiomani qachon ishlatsak bo'ladi? Sizning xassiz yaqin do'stingiz bor va boshqa do'stingiz undan pul so'ramoqchi. Another your friend is going to borrow money from him and he can use. He might lend you money when pigs fly. U balkim senga pul berib turar qachonki cho'chqalar uchganda. Do'stlar, Registon kanalini kuzatib boring. Siz bilan bo'lganimizdan xursandmiz.